One of the many, many great features of the mobile POS or MPOS is it being on the go. Let's check out how we can properly set it up prior to using it to your daily operations. Once you open it from your box, you'll find a smaller box which has the charger for the device, an extra paper roll, and the MPOS itself. Now remove the plastic sleeve and remove the screen protector of the MPOS. On the left side of the device, the smaller button is the power, while the longer button is for the volume. On the right side is the port for the charger. The orange part above is the printer paper storage. Lift the orange tab to open and refill the paper. Please note that this specific model is compatible to 57 to 59 mm thermal printer rolls. When you turn on your MPOS, directly go to settings first and turn on Bluetooth. From there, ensure that you're connected to inner printer. Exit that view, then go to Utek application and click on the main menu. From here, let's go to settings. And from here, let's ensure that the view override is set to mobile view to ensure that the user interface margins are not overlapping. Mini printer should be turned on as well so that it will print out correct margins on your receipt paper size. You may also turn on print order, which will serve as a kitchen slip later on for your operations. Scroll upwards up until you see printer. Ensure that both receipt and order printer is set to inner printer. After which, you can proceed back to register and start punching your sales. For specific how-tos on each tab, you can visit the other parts of this playlist to learn more. Once again, if you need any assistance, let us know in our group chat. Once again, happy selling!